All right, guys. Apparently, it'll only connect to other gold ones. Or, not to gold ones. I mean to stone ones. Which really has me even more confused. Because I don't understand why it only does with stone. Um, so, iron just does nothing, I guess. I don't, I don't know. I assumed iron pipes were like, just to step up, they go slightly faster or something. I don't know. But, um, I need glass, I need cobblestone. Not sure how much I need, but 32 should be plenty. These are, ah, does it need cobblestone or normal stone? Damn it! I don't know anything. Ah. And you are going to work. First, I need to stop this. And stone? Will you work when connected with redstone? Yes? Sort of. Sort of did work. Okay, iron seems to reverse it. Or something. I don't understand why iron won't work at all. Kind of just seems to suck ass. Um, but anyway, now I have to go through and replace all of my iron piping with cobblestone piping. Which is ridiculous. And really stupid. But, um, I don't understand this crap. Build craft, I don't know. You just kind of confuse me. So, if anyone knows what they're doing and feels like telling me how to do it, uh, feel free. You know, if you want to instruct me in the way of the build craft or whatever. I believe the uh, piping is build craft and the machines are industrial craft. I think that's how it works. I don't know. I'm pretty clueless, as I'm sure you can tell. I don't think it's even sort of hidden that I don't know what I'm doing here. Um, the steak. Yes. Nom nom nom. Because I never tried to work with quarries before because I was like, well, I could use quarries, or I could play this game like it's, you know, make it into a challenge. And I'm like, yes, I'll do the challenge way. Because that will be more interesting. And I was like, crap. It's, it, it doesn't make any sense. And, 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 wait, I don't know. Um, what was I actually talking about? Oh, right. The reason why I never use quarries um, is because quarries, to me, were kind of just like cheating. It would like take away all the mining and uh, blah blah. But for the purpose of this series at least, I want to try setting up a quarry because I've never done it before. And I know people do like them. So there must be something to it. Yeah. Damn, I can't move. But, anyway, as I am very clear, I can't do it like that. I need to stop being stupid. As I am clearly clueless as to what I'm doing, uh, like I said, if you want to be like, hey, you're stupid, here's how you do it, um, feel free to leave your comments down below. I'm sure you know how that works. It's pretty simple. Uh, you just put in your comments, and very unlike Buildcraft, it doesn't take too much thought. Um, do do do. I'll just do my little stagger thing. Because I don't care, and I'm running lower on the resources and such. Damn it. I did have to just block it all up, didn't I? Because I was like, well, it won't it won't be safe otherwise. Because then, uh, clearly I'm doing it right this time. And I'm not going to have to redo it. Then I found out I did. 
So now I'm going back in. I'm redoing it all with stone, well, cobblestone pipes. That should be plenty now. Okay then. And back to setting up all the piping. Uh, da, da, da. And this, and this, and you, and there. And that leads in, and everything is all just nice and dandy. And I can get back and cover it all up. And it should all be working. Okay then. Five more tries later. Me being completely clueless some more. But as I continue on in my cluelessness, I slowly learn. And as I slowly learn, crap, I'm still in the same episode. Oh, right, no, am I recording a new one? I don't know anymore. I'm so confused. I'm sure you can tell that by now. That I just don't know what I'm doing at this point. I'm clueless, I'm confused. And um, beyond all those things, um, maybe I could make... Wait, how do I suck oil? What, what would I suck oil with? Would that just be called like an oil rig? If I go down in here, type in oil, uh, fabricator, oil, 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 testicle, copper, coal. pump, maybe? Um, pump. Uh, that's a lot of iron, because that's a block of iron. Refined iron, even worse. An electronic circuit requires me to get cabling. Ugh. A mining well? And a tank makes a pump. And a mining well is a bunch of iron. Ugh. I wonder what a mining well does. Wait, it probably does the same exact thing. Um, so let me see. Wait, so if I run all the way back here, back into my house, it should be working? Yes! Yes! Work! Work! That doesn't seem to be working. Maybe I just have to wait and stuff will appear. So I will sit here and I will wait a moment. And see what happens. Also, what the hell? Pumpkin hollow anti cover. Oh god. Oh god, what was that noise? Spider inside here? No? Not in here. And where the hell is the spider? I can hear the spider. Spider, obviously, you know, being a spider. Does not care what I'm up to and does not care for me. And it's just a not it, it's not a nice creature. Spider. I'm going to Are you kidding me? Do I have to light every inch of this place? Also, I hate the skeletons are actually doing damage. Ugh, I'm so used to having full diamond armor. But that will one day come, maybe, for this series. I don't know if I really want to spend all that time mining. Just for a little Tech It series. But here's an oil place. So there's a lot of oil here. If I got just a pump, I guess, I could just feed directly into a combustion engine and power the pump with redstone engines, maybe? I don't know how this stuff works. Um, I wish I was, uh, damn it. Wait, what? You built, oh my god, creepers. Well, at least you blew each other up. No, not my piping. I really do hate that these things are just spawning like mad. And totally disproving my 25 blocks away from you. Uh, actually, no, that might only be true for the older version of Minecraft. Oh my god, creepers! And you blow up no matter how far away I walk. 
So I really can't do anything about creepers. Other than, you know, not get blown up with them. So I think I've lit the crap out of this place. As far as I'm concerned. Okay, the mining is going very, very slowly again. Um, it still has a coal in it. So if I dump one more piece of coal in. Um, I just kind of dumped all my coal into that stupid engine. But that's not the point here. The point here is to try and fabricate things. What? Uh. What's not working here? You know, I didn't want to have to do this, but I do. Okay, I especially shouldn't have done this at night. But you know, the point isn't that I do stupid things in the daytime only. It's just that mobs are going to be an issue. Anyway, on to trying to troubleshoot my contraption. What? Oh my god, I'm an idiot. Wait, but... Does it not go on a corner upward? Yeah, it does. Yeah, see? Worked that time. Okay, apparently I just hadn't constructed the entire pipe. Did... I didn't realize that. Thought I made the whole thing. Anyways, it actually starts to work now. And things go under? Yes, they do. So I can... Stupid thing. So I can keep my little observation up here to troubleshoot if there are more errors. Okay, it seems to be pumping it all back into the alchemical chest. Perfect. Doing exactly what I wanted for once. Now let's see. Yes. Slowly making stuff. Sorta. But the point isn't that it goes fast. The point is that it goes period. And that it does. Also, I need to make this higher. Darn. Dirt. I just don't care anymore. Stopped caring. I'm just putting up a wall to keep the mobs out. Oh man. I'm just getting like frustrated with this series. It is annoying. Stupid tech it. But now, as you can see, it is slowly but surely working and converting everything it pulls. And Oh man, I'm going to have to make sure nothing explodes over there. Can I just dump a bucket of water? No, no, I can't. Because if I'm stupid and I just dump a bucket of water on things, it'll knock out my redstone torches. Huh. So what can I do to... Okay, green. Green, that means it's slowly starting to overheat. Um, crap. I don't know how to not let it overheat. Like, is there a way? I'm going to try cheating by just putting a bucket of water here. See if that changes anything. There we go. Now I should be able to get out, go over here, and get myself some more water. And I have no idea if this is going to actually work. Wait, can I just pick up a bucket of... Oh. That was easy. I could use that to power my combustion engine for a short period of time, but uh, power it nonetheless. Because I don't think that'll go for very long. What I do know, on the other hand, is if I put this here, is it going to interfere? No, apparently not. Okay. Yes, it is.
So it's randomly filtering stone pieces and putting them in there. But um, in the meantime, I'm going to very slowly and meticulously grab a bucket of oil, dump the oil in, grab some oil, dump the oil in, grab some oil. You get the point. It's going to take some time. I'm also going to want to go like this. Just block it off for the moment. Because I don't want stuff just going in there like that. That's a problem. A very minor problem, but a problem nonetheless. And take my bucket. Take some oil. Why can't I take any more oil? There it goes. Okay, and I can just swim in oil like water. Whatever. Uh, so if you're down near the Gulf of Mexico, note, swimming it like water works exactly the same. Proven by me in Minecraft. Shut up. Anyway, no, oh, just do that. Slowly destroy my oil geyser by dumping it into the combustion engine. Okay, but anyway, these should not still be green like they are. Um, I feel like if they explode, something terrible is going to happen. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to at least just... Ah, uh, I can't move that now. But I have to make sure everything remains blue and not green, because green is not a good color. Uh, at least not for this. For other things, I guess green is really never a bad color. But um, anyway, I'm just going to check online real quick. Okay, from reading online, it said that my redstone engine shouldn't have been turning red and thus coming near explosion. What it also said is that my combustion engine here needs water by it or else it will explode and there is just, like, there's no other choice. It needs water or it will explode. Um, there's apparently no leniency to this. And, uh, you know, if I don't power it, it will explode. Or, if I don't put water next to it, it will explode. That's what I meant. Um, now the other thing... So I do need to block this off temporarily using the dirt. There we go. D dirt. Block. Good. Redstone dirt. Um, I want water here, water here, and water here. So I'm actually going to be placing my bucket of water right here to make sure things won't explode. Pick this up, put it right there to make sure things don't explode. <gasps> oh god, why are these turning red? Oh god, what's going on? Oh, no, no, no. I can't have these turning red. What, why are they turning red when I put water near them? That one's not turning red. Okay, um, I'm clueless as to why these were changing color. But uh, what I do know is that that is a bad sign. So what I'm going to do is just go like this, and this, and that, and where else did I put it? Yeah. Good. Good, good, good. So now everything's coming out of it, working nice and quick. Real quick, like, check on this. It's got plenty of oil in it. Earl. Oh. 